Okay, let's start with the search using the Creative Commons search portal. So if I, I'm going to search for an image of a dog, so I type it in here and I, I can choose one of these or both if I want it for commercial use or not, uh, or if I want it for, to be able to modify. I, if I don't click any of them, I just want to be able to use it. So um, I can then choose which one I want it to search in. And if it's since I want an image, I think I'll just choose Google Images. And notice what comes up. Here's our Google Images that you're familiar with. And because of what we selected, it's labeled for non-commercial reuse. So I'm not modifying it. And I only want it for non-commercial uses. So I'm going to choose this image here of the dog. Um, and I'll go to the visit the page because I want to find the license uh, details. Um, so I'll click down here to where he is, click on him, and here he comes up here. So I can see here, here's the license here, but uh, I want to make my life easy and go find uh, where I can just copy and paste the attribution. I'm going to just right click and copy my image. I could download him, but I'm I don't need him for to keep on file, so I'm just going to copy him, and uh, then I'll go back here, and I will go as if I'm going to download because I just want to show you how you can choose your different image uh, file sizes or how big your image will be. Uh, so I'll, mine will be the size that of this image that I've just copied, but if I wanted a smaller one, I could choose a smaller one. But I'm after this. Bit here. This is the attribution that tells me who the owner is and what the license is. So if I right click and copy that and I can paste it underneath, underneath the word doc. Okay, so where am I? Just here. So I can just paste that here. Okay, so now I've made the correct attribution. Okay, the other way, and we'll just close off here. If I go to Google, this is going directly there because most of the time you can just go straight. So I'll do the same process. I'm after an image of a dog and uh, images. And this time if I go, I can go to search tools here and that will give me the usage rights. So again, this is the one I had before. Um, but maybe I want to use reuse it for non-commercial and I might want to modify it. So I'll choose that one and I might go to this one and uh, visit page. Yes. And just quickly, I'll go back here. Um, notice this one here is from Commons Wikimedia. Oh, I like these ones because I know when I click on the page, it comes straight to this. So I'm just going to right click copy just to show and uh, put him underneath, paste uh, and then I'll come back here, get the attribution and do the same thing. Okay, so attribution here, copy it, go back to my document and just paste it underneath and that's it. And the other thing I should have mentioned is that we should copy the, the URL to the image as well, which you can get from here. So you need to also right click that and copy it into you under your image. OK, so once you've done, this is what it should look like. So I've got the image, I've got the attribution code and I've also got a link uh, to to the actual image. So. That link takes you to the information about the license and this link takes you to the image.